Good morning, everybody, and this is your S&P 500 day trade setups for today. So, um, yeah, I suppose that'll serve me right for trying to short this thing. Um, I was expecting a second move with the power of that move to the downside, and you know, how wrong I was on that. So, long it is, uh, we have closed above this level that we have been flirting with for quite some time, which is 3401. Uh, there is another high here, which is uh, what's that, 3430, which we also need to break before we can target the the all-time highs here. So that's kind of the structure at the moment, but that is significant. Um, you can see that pin bar up, pull back, and then a pretty solid green bar open on its low, close on its high. So that is bullish in my view it's a solid bar within the trend okay so just recapping what happened we had a strong move down and then immediately the buyer stepped in and they've been buying all the way through okay so what i'm looking for at the moment i'm just going to fine tune that and add one down there right so i'm looking for a break and we need to just bring this down right onto price. You can see there my tails. There's my tails. And I just want to do that. Okay, so we have a pretty messy inverse head and shoulders here. You can see here's your shoulder, here's your head, here's your shoulder. Um, this is the line in the sand right now. So 34.27, let's say 34.28 um, is the level that needs to go. We need to get above it. We need to come back and test it, and then we have a clear run at all-time highs. Okay, so that's what we're looking for at the moment. We are making high highs, we are making high lows. So this channel that we're in, let's get the channel tool. This channel that we're in is going to continue as far as I'm concerned. So any move to the downside is worth buying. If, so if we do get another massive move to the downside with a tweet or something stupid coming through, um, it's an opportunity to buy. Don't even bother trying to short this. Let's not even get that notion into our heads. Uh, what we're looking for is opportunities to buy. Okay, so for me at the moment, there isn't really an opportunity at this level that we're at. Let's just do that. So we are toying with this. It's the Asian session. Uh, your volumes are low. So I would expect to move down to 3410, possibly even 3396. Okay, but that 3400 area, I definitely believe it will be defended. So 3410, 3400, um, this zone here is, will be defended. So what we want is a move into this area, opportunity to buy, anticipating a break of this uh, 3427 or 3428. A break above that is going to be fairly clear for me. And I would expect to move up to the top of the channel, then probably a retest of this um, 3428 area before either staying in the channel like this moving up or getting a break above the channel finding support on the top of the channel and then making a stab to the previous all-time highs okay so i just want to put a couple more levels in here and one more right so those are my target area so first target area will be 3471 then we have um, 3503 and then we have uh, 3522 uh, those are the areas that I'm looking to target to the upside okay obviously we want to pull back onto support right now that's 3410 we want to buy off or alternatively 3396 uh, if it does fall which is possible because uh, V reversals are rare. Um, if it does fall, it could come down to the bottom of the channel. I definitely buy off the bottom of the channel. Um, alternatively, I would be buying off any one of these levels to the downside. Okay. Okay, so that's it for me, short and sweet. Uh, wait for the pullback and then look for your opportunity to buy. Uh, just watch your levels, watch the channel. And um, you want to be taking profit at every, pretty much at every level you get to, rather take profit, wait for it to pull back onto another level and then buy back into it. So you only want to be going long 
and you can get on the 15 minute for this you can see a good example of why you want to be on the 15 minutes break through the moving average come back find support great opportunity to buy there another opportunity to buy there uh, either that one or that one and we haven't come back onto this area here so 3 4 10 looks like a decent area for us to wait for this and get back in long okay um, Anyway, that's it for me today, guys. Hope it helps, and uh, we will catch you later. Cheers for now.